Hi, would you like to work out how to become a positive step parent and not one who finds fault or criticises? Hi, subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell and I'll let you know every time I post. You don't want to be one of these negative, complaining, critical um, people who spot everything that's wrong all the time. And it's very easy to fall into spotting what's wrong, especially if the children are not your own. So you can, you can go about your day and be irritated by all the things that you notice. And so what do you do? You point them out. And you might think, how can I point this out positively? How can this be not a negative experience? Well, there is a way and this is it. What you do, and it takes a little bit more effort on your part to do it, but I can tell you it's really worth it, is to not say anything at the time. Anything that you dislike that's going on will happen again. Because once somebody's done something once, they get into the habit of doing it time and time again. So the way you address issues positively is to mention them before they happen again, not after they've just happened. So if you say something, however nicely, however diplomatically, however non-offensively to somebody the moment it's happened and say, you've done it again, it'll come across as a negative. And what you've got to do is you mention it before it happens again, or at least a long time away from when it happened last time. So you, 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 you tell them in anticipation, not in retrospect. That way they can do it and then please you and then you can praise you, praise them for it, and it's a positive experience. So it's a meal time and you're just about to sit down or you're just about to prepare for the meal or whatever it happens to be, and you'll say, could you make sure that the knives are on the right and the forks are on the left? Or could you make sure that everybody's got a glass before we sit down or whatever it, or whatever whatever it is you want to change talk about it just as it's about to happen again rather than when it hasn't happened last time and that way you switch what you're doing from being negative and critical to being positive encouraging working in anticipation and able to praise because they've laid the, the table you come to the table knives are in the right place fork is in the right place you can then say fantastic you've done that completely right you've got the knife and fork in the right place and it's great they feel good for having done it it works and if you do this time and time and time again you can work with positive parenting, not negative. <laughs> we run workshops, sessions, an email response service, we write booklets, and you can find links to our social media and website in the description box below.